Rise from your grave. Hello Quakers and welcome once again to another edition of the Quake Grave. Today we're taking a look at a map called the Downward Spiral. This is by Stan C and came out on December 27th of 1996. So let's follow the Downward Spiral and see where it takes us. Okay, we start our spiral downward. Little intro by Stan C there. We have a few Hell Knights waiting for us on the other side. Not really anything else going on. I guess some water on the bottom there and a weapon, so I'm... Ooh, I am just gonna go for it. As we jump into the piranhas. I thought I saw a weapon spinning down here. Did I just see, just see a fish? Is that what I saw? No, there is a weapon right there. Our super nail gun. Got it! Okay, moving on. Let's go check out what uh, secrets await us down here. Woo! Wind tunnel. Whoa. Okay. Oh boy. Okay, we got... Wow. Scrags. Oh crap, we probably don't want to go into that. Nope. Don't. Do we? Okay, maybe we do. I don't... What is happening? <laughs> wow, that spit us out quick. Alright, I'm just... I'm gonna head back up here. See if I can take out these Hell Knights. I don't know what the hell I was supposed to do in that area. But I have a feeling that, my friends, was the Downward Spiral. Oh, oh man, how did I escape that? I have an absolute crap ton of shells here, so I'm just gonna take these guys out first. Okay. Jump over here, make our way to some health. Some much needed health, might I add, after uh, that, that weird room we were just in. And this will open. I had a feeling that there was going to be a key or something waiting for us. Great, a fiend. Just what I wanted. You're going to be able to make it across that, though. Aren't you? Yes, you are. No! Oh, man. Okay. Really should have saved those nails I got at the beginning, I guess. Alright, this is one... One dark area here. Oh, great, another one. Ugh! Will he follow me? Oh, of course. Whoa! Oh, and there you go, into the water. Okay, we'll... <laughs> we'll ignore him for now, I guess. But I have a feeling we're gonna have to deal with him later. I am running out of shells quick. I had a absolute ton of shells, but when you got no gun besides the shotgun here, you tend to go through them pretty quick. Here we go. Got a nail gun. We got some armor on the other side. These doors are going to open with some enemies. Shells, armor. There they are. Wow, there are... Okay, it's just the four. I was like, man, when I first saw dudes coming out, I was like, there are... <laughs> A lot of guys coming after me, but it's not bad. There we go. Okay. And luckily, we got a ton of shells back, so we're doing okay here. Looks like we got a couple buttons, one more to go. What's this going to do? Sequence completed. And, of course, your friend in mind, the ogres. The way they came out on stage there, I almost feel like they should have had like a dance number or something. Enjoy everyone, the ogres! Da 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 da. There we go, some nails. We're definitely gonna need those at some point. Uh, and we got another button. Ooh, and it reveals a new area with reckless abandon. Let's just go. Oh man, it is. It is so dark. I'm not quite sure what I did with this button here, but something just happened. We we are now committing to being down here. Oh, do not like that. Okay, we got some scrags here. Nothing we can't handle though. Where are you at? Ah, it's dark. 
Whoa, these... Okay, those are reaching now. I have no desire to fight these guys while trying to jump <laughs> across this chasm. There's absolutely no way. Though it does look like there's an easy way to get over there on the side here. Okay, he's done. Yeah, let's let's avoid that middle area. Right? That was a secret area. Wow, that was really nice. Mega health and everything. I like that. Now, can we... Oh, can I actually jump up here? Come on, the ogre was up there. Oh, don't fall in the lava. Oh, okay. I really thought <laughs> that was my doom. Okay, Scrag is down. Yeah, we got some s spiral staircase down this way. Whoa! Spiral staircase does not reach. I repeat, it does not reach. Where are we going here? Here we go. Oh, not, not exactly who I wanted to see around the corner. There we go. Hate those guys. How many monsters we got in this one? 24 out of 40. Okay. So we're, we're a little over halfway. We're doing good here. Ooh, look out. Some traps. Double scrag. There we go. Now we gotta get this ogre. We don't need the health yet, but I'd rather save it for something more important. Okay, I guess we'll try to jump up on these. Quake platforming at its finest, right? And up we are. Okay. And some more nails, and away we go. Gold key! Oh, crap. No, oh, get away from me. Oh, that's right. The old fiend can't fit in the doorway trick. Gets him every time. Works for me. Good God. One thing I will say is I'm glad I <laughs> saved uh, some health over in this side. I can just jump down, grab this, and there we go. We're back up to 78. Our Quake Guy portrait is still not super happy, but you know what? 78 is a lot better than 28 or 29, whatever I was at. Oh, man. I did it perfectly the first time. Now this is going to take me several tries, isn't it? Yikes. Okay. Here we go. Oh, oh. Oh, boy. I guess this is a good example of why uh, a lot of contemporary Quake mappers do not put too much platforming into their levels. It's not exactly... Or we'll just say it's not an exact science, that's for sure. Some levels do do it better than others, but it's... It's almost never that enjoyable. I guess we gotta go down this way. Oh, there we are again. Last I remember, there was a fiend down here, right? Did he die? Or did he run? He did run all the way over here. I knew it. He's in the wind tunnel. I have a feeling he's going to kill me if I get too close. <laughs> I'll just uh, end up uh, shooting through him, and he'll he'll be attacking me as I as I try to get through him. Let's go for it. Yep, there he is. Oh my god! <laughs> exactly what I thought was going to happen. Oh my god, I, I think he's... Oh, I, okay. I, I don't want to see what he's doing to my dead body. Okay, here we are back at this part, and the fiend is waiting for me again. So I gotta try to... There we go. Take him out. We got him. Let's, let's sail through here. See if we can get our, ourselves to the end of the downward spiral. Ooh, some health. Definitely needed. Okay, we swim up. We got an ogre on the other side. Try to take him out as quick as we can. There we go. You're done. 
Oh, it's pulling me. It's pulling me. I can't get away. Okay, we're just gonna go for it. We spit us back out. There we are. Whew. That is one crazy ride going down the waterfall and everything. Very interesting that it's all interconnected that way too. Alright, let's give this another shot. See if we can get to the, the ogre's landing over there. Just hug the wall. Hopefully it won't pull me over. Because we got the gold key, and you can tell on the ogre's landing here, this is obviously... Oh, come on, jump up there. What are you doing? There we go. This is obviously the gold key door, so in we go. What is awaiting us? There's a, got about seven enemies left. There's a rune. So we're going to have... Uh, looks like a little bit of a spawn fight here. I'm at full nail, so that's good. I got the rune. Yeah, I think... Is that our friend the Shambler waiting for us? It looks that way. Ooh, wasting nails, wasting nails. There we go. Not that time, though. Alright, we got the Shambler. What is next? Oh, okay, we got a button here. What did that open? It opened one straight on. Is another shambler? Who's in here? Oh, and that's the end. Okay. Well, I guess the enemies left there might be... Um, I've heard that there's some sort of issue with certain engines displaying the amount of actual fish enemies that are in certain maps. I, I don't know. So that, that could be it, or maybe we missed a whole section. We, we did miss a secret, so maybe we missed a whole section with six more enemies. So there we have it, uh, the Downward Spiral. I I think this is one of the best maps from 1996. It's it's well paced, it's unique, you know, it's it does something cool with the the water stuff there. Uh, it's challenging, uh, but not so challenging that you can't finish it. Uh, and you know what, the, the video, <laughs> when that fiend was stuck in the wind tunnel there, uh, it gave us a really funny uh, death scene there. A lot of times when you die in Quake, you know, you're you're either like, oh, the map got me, or, man, that sucked. There's no way, no reason why I should have died right there, but that <laughs> that was just really funny. Um, but yeah, I, I would definitely say give this one a shot. This is a, a really fun map. Uh, I think it's, uh, like I said, really well paced, really well put together. For 1996, uh, I, I think it's one of the best of that year. Until next time, Quakers.